Welcome to Meridian High School. My name is Georgina Watson. I'm Senior Assistant Head Teacher and an English teacher here at the school. A year ago we became an amazing people school. Today we're going to do a tour around the school to show you what that means at Meridian. I'm about to deliver an assembly this morning on the subject of creativity and we've linked that amazing behaviour characteristic to Albert Einstein. If you'd like to bring the students in, thank you. Einstein wasn't an exceptional student and the word genius didn't appear on any of his school files. We have amazing people in assemblies once every week where a teacher explains an amazing person and goes through their history, the characteristics they showed. There is now an increasing belief and evidence that Einstein actually grew parts of his brain through thousands of hours of deliberate practice. Amazing people assemblies are inspiring because it shows us that we could do what they're doing and how to do it in the same way that they did it. With effort and deliberate practice, you can be exceptional or even more exceptional. I find it very inspiring actually because they're not that different from us. There's nothing stopping me from becoming them as well. You have to make a conscious decision today to deliberately grow your brain and embrace those challenges. Right, morning Atiste. Today's amazing person lesson is on, hands up, Harriet Tubman. Using the Amazing People curriculum is a terrific way to introduce really big, really important themes. You're going to learn about her, find out the ways, the many, many ways she demonstrated perseverance and courage. Well, another big advantage of the Amazing People's curriculum is you can go to the website, you can download the resources, you can download the worksheets, you can print them off, give them to the kids. So if somebody comes along and produces excellent resources for you, you grab them with both hands and say thank you. I hope you can all agree that Harriet Tubman deserves to be called amazing. Well done, you lot. Perseverance and courage, Harriet Tubman, well done. My name is Brandon, I'm part of the Student Council, and today we're going to have a discussion on the Amazing People School's website. The fact that they use new characters that we haven't necessarily seen in lessons is quite inspiring because it's new content that we haven't covered before. We're more encouraged to carry on like persevering, learning about them. We learn about the amazing people through the school's website, through the watching, the listening and the reading. So if you find it hard to read, you can just listen and watch, so it's easy. Charlie, what did you think on the quiz that you took on Mahatma Gandhi? It allowed us to be involved with the website, so it engaged us more. The Amazing People's website has been helping me feel more inspired to be focused like the people we see. Amazing behaviour characteristics uh, allow our students, in my opinion, to emulate the amazing people. The amazing person who inspires me the most would have to be Albert Einstein. He couldn't read until the age of seven and his resilience and his willingness to keep trying and trying, that resilience inspires me a lot. To measure and track how students are developing character is actually really hard. What Amazing People Schools has given us is the vehicle to be able to do that, to capture where it's happening, to highlight where we have deficits, to look at how we can support our students better. So it's really helped us to build character education in the school. I think inspiration is important in schools because it gives you something to aim for and something to look up to and to know where you've got to go to get there. What I'd say to other schools is you really can use this in an entirely bespoke way. It was important for us to look at our students' knowledge of some of these key historical characters and understand who they are and the impact that they've had. So we wanted to make sure that it was part of their day-to-day -day experience. However, if you just wanted to use it in a lesson as a drop-down day, the resources are all there and you can really use it however you like. We've also made sure that when staff are awarding uh, Meridian Mars for the amazing behaviour characteristics, it's entirely seamless with our SIMS and class chart system. We haven't created a system where there's a burden of paperwork or administration for staff. Actually, it's easier than previous systems we've had. I like being part of the Amazing People School. It has inspired me to go to sixth form, then university, and take a course that I enjoy doing, and no one can tell me not to do it because it's my choice. <laughs>